Hello everybody. Today I'm going to be doing another track versus track. This time instead of doing band versus band, I'm just going to be doing band versus themselves, actually. So, what I mean by that is like I'm going to uh, do uh, each track from the band's, like their album versus their own album again. So, this one, uh, by the way, uh, this idea was brought to me by As It Should Be. Subscribe to him. Uh, put his put the link to his channel in the description, like I've been doing. And yeah, subscribe to him. You don't have to, but you have to. <laughs> uh, who's next? Versus who are you? I think this is an easy one because both have nine tracks on it, so I thought this would be an easy one. Um. First one, Bob O'Reilly versus who are uh <laughs> versus new song I mean, the but uh yeah, I'm gonna write down this guys. so who next. Versus, who are you? Okay. Well, winner of the first track is going to be Bob O'Reilly. I think it's a, I think it's a sh slightly better strong opener than, uh, than, um, who are you? Next track. Bargain. Versus. Had enough. And uh. This might be a hard one. Hmm. This is a hard one. I, I like Bargain a lot. But I really like Had Enough. Had Enough. Yeah. Just. Better, better song. If I had a choice between that or the other, I'd pick that one. Love Aim for Keeping versus 905. And. Never mind. Drop the cap. But, uh. This might be a hard one. Well, not a hard one, but this might be an easy one for some people. Might a lot of people might pick uh, who's next over it. Uh, but uh, we got to pick 905. It's another song for me that just not that it was not that it was an easy choice. Uh, both songs are just great, but 905 is just slightly better. Uh, my wife. Versus Sister Disco. Uh, I love Sister Disco to death. But. I like my wife a lot better. So. Have to give it. Give it to that. Who's next? Uh, the song is over. Versus. Music must change. This was an easy one. This was really easy. Uh, uh, this song is over. M much easy. So easy. That song blows music. Music must change out of the park. No, no, no uh, contest on that one. Uh, getting in tune versus. Uh, Trick of the Light. Both open up side two and both do it strongly. You know, I don't do this that often, but I'm going to give it a... I don't think I did it at all, but if I did... You could, I think, if I did, I did once, but I have to give it a tie. Both songs are too strong for me to for me to give one a point. I love Trick of the Light and I love get, getting in tune. 
uh, going mobile versus guitar and pen. Easy. Guitar and pen. I mean, I love going mobile in a way, but no comparison. Um, uh, Behind Blue Eyes versus Love is Coming Down. Both are strong tracks, but I'm going to have to give this one, this one to uh, Love is Coming Down. I like it better. Just a better song. I love Behind Blue Eyes. Don't get me wrong. It's a solid track, but I don't know. Much prefer, I much prefer Love Coming Down. Uh, last track on the album. Uh, Won't Get Fooled Again. Which is Sound Lab's favorite song off this album. Versus the title track. And I like... Won't Get Fooled Again a lot. It's a rock staple. It's one of the most... It's one of the most recognizable rock songs of all time. Everyone knows it. But it's played to death. I'm real sick and tired of hearing that song. Plus, I've never been... To be honest, I've never been a big, big fan of that song. It's a great... It's a good track, but it's not like one of those that I ever got real excited for even when i was listening to this album constantly this was never a song that i like was looking forward to like a lot to it's not a song that i'm like ah oh, taking the record off this record's over it's one of those songs that make me go it's great but you know it's not perfect so yeah you have to give this one a Who Are You? And Who Are You wins by two points uh, with a six, six to four. And by the way, uh, I gave them a point e each for the tie, so that's why it adds up to ten. But overall, I like this album better than Who's Next, but not by much. You can put down in the comments what yours would be, but that's what mine is. So, see you next time. Have a good one.